Hey guys, you're with me, Kevin, your scuba professional, and today we're here to have a quick look at the Mares Touch gloves available on our website. These are two millimeter thick neoprene gloves. First we're gonna take the packet out the way and uh, recycle it, get out the way. And then here we have our two millimeter gloves. So it's two millimeter neoprene the whole way around. It's been stitched all the way around the fingers just to give it extra reinforcement. It's got uh, some really great Mares branding at the side and on the top of your index finger it says, touch. Um, across the palm of the hand it has a rubberized type paint to give you a lot of extra grip and it's, uh, it says Mares. It's a nice little detail that it's got there. So it's Mares branding. Mares, 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 Mares and that uh, really funky rubberized type paint they've got there. And I see that it comes quite high up over the, the wrist. So it's going to come over the, the bone and the top of your wrist over there. So that will make it uh, nice and warm when you're wearing it. As far as the glove is concerned when I've got it on You've got a really good sense of feel in the, the glove, so it hardly feels like you're wearing anything. So if you were working with cameras, etc., and you needed to touch the buttons, I feel you, you get a really good grip of the camera. You'd be able to scroll through the navigations, or if you're working with any knives or any other tools, it would be quite easy to do so with this. Because it's uh, neoprene the whole way around, it will go a long way to reduce the amount of water in the in the. In, around your hands. Um, I wouldn't wear it in super cold diving. For that, I'd rather opt for a dry glove or one of the th thicker semi-dry gloves. So this would be good for slightly cooler waters, Aliwal Shoal, Port Elizabeth, those types of areas. Um, as far as Cape Town's concerned, in the middle of winter, this wouldn't work. But in those uh, more temperate type waters, this type of glove would uh, would be ideal. And when you finish with it, you just to go rinse it all off with a bit of uh, wetsuit shampoo. So I reckon it's a really, really great set of gloves it'll go a long way to keep your hands warm in those slightly chillier waters if you're going on those sardine runs or Eliwal shoal when the raggies are there in winter this is definitely a pair of gloves that you're going to need um, and they'll last a really good time just a point to remember double check if you're allowed to wear gloves in certain marine protected areas so areas like uh, Sudwana Bay ecosystem you're not allowed to wear gloves uh -uh -uh. so you wouldn't be allowed to wear these there but in other areas where there's wrecks etc you can wear the gloves and that'll go a long way to protect your fingers from the fire coral and everything else as well so overall I think every diver needs at least one set of gloves when they go diving just so they can protect their hands from the likes of fire coral as well as keep your hands warm in cooler waters if you guys are enjoying the product reviews, please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Just go over there, see where those fingers are, click subscribe, and uh, that will keep you up to date with all the really funky product reviews that we do. We're on a mission to do a review of every single piece of scuba gear that there is on the market today. So that means there's lots more videos to come. You can also go check out our social streams, main one being facebook.com forward slash scuba.co.za. You can also get Instagram and Twitter, go give us a search, we're bound to come up. So that's it from me guys, and I look forward to seeing you really soon in the water.